So we're here in Goa driving the Mercedes-Benz A-Class sedan. Uh, this is Mercedes-Benz entry into the entry-level sedan market. Not, not really entry because they had the CLA which was based on the old A-Class platform. Uh, which if you remember the old A-Class was just available as a hatchback. This time around they made the A-Class into a sedan straight off. Um, it's a good looking car and it's nice to drive. It goes up against the BMW 2 Series Grand Coupe and while the BMW uh, is a bit more involving to drive, this car ticks all the boxes in terms of practicality. Of course, a lot will depend on how Mercedes prices the car. They are giving a three year full comprehensive warranty and an eight year engine and transmission warranty. So you, know, you don't really worry about it. The car is a lit, little less powerful than the uh, competing BMW. I mean, 40 PS less than the BMW on the diesel, which is what we are driving today. And um, honestly, it's quite a nice car to drive. I mean, you don't feel the lack of power. You like the fact it's got all the features that even the E-Class and the C-Class have, like the twin screen MBUX system, uh, a bit smaller than the E-Class and the C-Class, very honestly, but it's got ambient lighting, it's got the toys, rear legroom, not bad. I mean, this car is almost as large as, uh, you know, the E-Class uh, e e back in the day, the W124, the one that Mercedes-Benz came to India with almost uh, 25 years ago now so yeah much different very nice car to drive will be interesting to see what happens in the market going forward i mean the entry level luxury segment of course keep in mind that this car will be pricier than um, hyundai elantra or skoda octavia that level of cars but of course you get the three-pointed star up front and you are paying essentially for badge value um, it will only be sold in one spec level, be it, uh, unlike the competition, they don't want to have multiple specs. It's going to have a panoramic sunroof, as you can see, we have, and uh, full LED lights, super bright LED lights, we are told, the same digital display, everything in one variant. So yeah, nice car, should be interesting to see what happens in the market going forward.